Howdy, this is Pell Ryder on the Van Freedom server, and welcome back. I haven't recorded in a while. Um, been uh, real busy in my personal life, and uh, because of the holidays and things like that. And um, it's probably been about three weeks, I think, since I recorded anything. Um, I've got a few things things up. Uh, well, I, I have recorded the UHCs and got them up, but um, <clears throat> stuff on the server itself, um, no, I haven't got anything out since the middle of middle of December, I guess. Yeah. So yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Little update before I show you my current project. I haven't done a whole lot. That's another reason I haven't recorded. Um, been busy doing other things, like I said. Uh, yeah, I did finally make me a nether tunnel. It's pretty short. <laughs> you know, there's the spawn portal, and there's my portal. I'm not too far away, uh, as you've seen on the other videos. You know, it doesn't take me a whole long time on a horse to get across the bridge. But, um, yeah, it also made me some banners. Also, um, pink. Pink uh, Linkus, which has been on the only two videos that I've got up in the last week. Uh, she came on, I think, at the end of November or the starting of December. Um, this is what she's been mostly doing lately. Is she did this is her tunnel, pretty fancy. Needed a girl's touch around here, and. Looks a lot nicer than any of the guys' tunnels. Um, this goes all the way to her portal with a couple couple branches off. She did this one that goes to um, LC's portal. She just kind of made it look a little bit different in here for his. It looks like it needs a roof, though. I don't think she's finished with it yet. Or maybe she's <laughs> wanting him to finish it. I don't know. Um, she also branched off here since the Mesa Tunnel was... Um, <clears throat> the Mesa Path was taking the same path up to this point. Uh, she just branched off of here and gave it a completely different look. Looks, you know, more southwestern looking. Turned out really nice. Oh, still needs a roof over here. Oh, this was uh, completely glass where you can see the lava below. I guess she covered that up. Uh, yeah, it's looking good. I think she, last time I was out here, she had it out to this point. Yep. Oh, when well she went up a little higher with the actual floor part. Oh, she might have went all the way there. Mesa portal is just right up over here. Um, oh, yeah, that's where she got. Portal's just right there. So, yeah, she got pretty far. Oh, this was a lot lower, too. She brought it all the way up so that... I think this was a lot lower before. Hmm. All righty. So, um, yeah, I'm going to uh, pause the video a second, and I'll be back with you when I get back to my base. All right. Be right back. All right, I'm back to my base. Um, this is under the barn. I'm not sure how much of this I've shown in the past. I finally finished it pretty much and put my portal in here. Got a big-ass um, two-wide portal. It's actually two portals put together. Um, I was needed to make it an even number, you know. I couldn't keep it one wide because it just wasn't centered. I, I did have it one wide for a while and it was bugging me so bad that I just doubled it up. Um, yeah, I wanted it to kind of be imposing in here and take up the whole center of the room to give something to this. It was pretty bare in the middle before that. So yeah, um, the storage system, I was going for a completely automatic storage system but it just wasn't working on the server um 
there was some problems with 1.8 and problems with um, the ticks on the server due to maybe not having enough memory or maybe just our host, the hosting company, whatever. Um, yeah, we were having problems. I did have it working for a while. Uh, I got this, these first three rows going, and um, I had so many hoppers that I, after, after calculating and finishing this whole room, it would have been, I would have had to have 17,000 iron ingots to, to finish the whole place. And um, that's just not doable. I calculated it. It would, would have taken me, I don't know, eight to ten months, I think, to get that much. Uh, yeah, I just decided to screw it. I actually compacted it down for uh, a couple days. I had the first and part of the second row compacted down just to see if it would work. And it seemed to work okay, except... There were some tick issues where items would just skip right over the item sorter and, and end up in the you know the junk chest at the end. So I just decided just to go completely manual. It's a pain, but oh well. <laughs> so I'll have to come up with another big redstone project. That was going to be my big redstone project for this this server, but. Or for this map. I'll figure something else out. Okay, also I got three beacons now. Um, and I have enough to make a couple more. I think enough for, for three more beacons. Um, I, oh, I don't have all the iron yet, though. I'm still working on the iron. Iron seems to be a problem. <laughs> What's up with you? Get back in there. <laughs> Look funny. Phasing through there. So yeah, I'm going to put another beacon probably at the other end over there. And um, in my new project, which is going to be over there, I'm going to put probably put the other two. Um, oh, I finally pretty much got the barn the way I want it. But um, I got some stalls in here. Got a hayloft. I need to put more hay in it, and I might add a little bit more in here, and plus these little rooms on the side. I have one on each side. I need to do something with this. Some kind of a tool room, something, I don't know. Um, the stables are exactly how they were on my last few videos, except I moved all the stuff that was in the front. You know, I had some chests there. All this, Most of the chests are down in there now. You know, all the stuff that was in the chest. And my enchanting station is over here at the house. Um, let me run over there a second. Yeah, I think I was still working on the house the last on the last video. I'm not sure. Yeah, I fancied it up a little bit. Put have plenty of freaking poppies. I put poppies all the way around it from the golem farm. Um, Christmas presents up here. Kitchen with a uh, refrigerator. I had some steaks in here, but um, I just used the last, I grabbed the last couple a while ago. Um, got some cabinets with hidey holes in both sides. Sink and range, range hood, and an island in the middle, and dining room area over here with a big ass dining room table. And a little living room area with this. And I don't, I, I've never worked with a lot of wood before in a, around a fireplace, but I did get a fire in here and it burned down half my roof. So I'm going to have to figure out something else. <laughs> that wasn't good. In this area I need to figure out what to do with still and upstairs is my bedroom area I haven't done a whole lot with this I got my bed in here and a few things on the wall and the enchanting station I still need to come up with something better in here this looks like crap <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing 
but yeah, the enchanting station, uh, I might move somewhere else. I don't know. And do something else with this bedroom. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm doing yet, but all right. So that's the update. And now take you to what I'm doing now. Um, I've been wanting, I even I think I mentioned it before. I was going to build a, a western town over in the desert, like an old old western like town ta town with a saloon and a jailhouse, livery stable, crap like that. But I just I started thinking. I I actually thought somebody was building something back here, but the only thing that was built is um, Pink built a lighthouse. Oh, I haven't shown that yet either. I don't think this has been in any of my videos. She built this lighthouse over here. Pretty nice. It's on the there's a coast right there too. Um, so I think I'm going to build my whole western town right here. I already laid out the center of town. I'm going to have this road probably seven or nine wide um, with shops and stuff down both sides. have to do a lot of terraforming first and then I'm gonna lay out the um, each of the buildings probably I don't know 12 13 buildings I, I think at the end right here I'm gonna put the like a jailhouse or courthouse or something at the end um, bank maybe I'm not sure but yeah at the end right here and then I'll have it the road wrap around over to the lighthouse. Well, the lighthouse turned out pretty nice, I think. I don't know what I haven't looked at it the inside since she got it done. I built built the doors for. Her. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, can you get up there? Oh, I like to see my um, area from here probably. Oh, yeah, that's supposed to be the light. <laughs> hey, oh, it's missing a pane. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah, so yeah, I'm gonna ha I'll go right down the middle and have um, shops and stores and stuff on both sides with something big on this side, maybe the saloon. And I'll ha I'm going to have a crossroads in the middle there somewhere. Uh, that's what I really wanted to do is put the saloon on a corner. So I think I'm probably going to put the saloon in there. I'm going to have a crossroads there with a saloon on one side and maybe a general store, a ball ball, you know, and then put a jailhouse or something on this side and then a livery stable on the other end of town. But, yeah, I, I, I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing with it yet. But it's like most things that I build. It'll <laughs> it'll take shape as I'm working on it. I really don't know what it's going to look like till I'm done. Till I'm in the process of freaking laying down the the bricks and the wood, and well, it's probably going to mostly be wood. Most old Western towns were just <laughs> shacks. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I think this this will work out good. I'm gonna. I guess I'm gonna probably end the video here. Uh, once I get this all laid out and start building on it, then I'll uh, do my next video. It might be in the next day or so, hopefully. Um, so yeah. Well, good to be back on Fan Freedom and making videos, and I'm hoping I can get them out. A little bit more often so uh we'll see you next time adios wow.